Hello, and welcome to War Thunder. Today we're taking a look at some of the carpets again, and by some of the carpets I mean this is the carpet for the B-17E. Uh, the, not the late version, just the normal version, and I know it's not the most HD or most beautiful thing, and it's definitely a, um, like, graphical, it's a step down from the HE-111, which I showed you earlier, but come on, it's still, it's, it's, it's almost embarrassing how people have already made this a possibility. Whereas Gaijin has, been, has had trouble trying to do this for, I don't know, a year or two now? When they announced bomber cockpits were supposed to be a thing? Um, then again, I know this is like not a bomber cockpit, it's probably like a fighter cockpit, judged by the, the stick and... I know this is not like an, a realistic B-17 interior, don't get me wrong, I'm not stupid. But at least it does look cool and it's something you don't really get in the in the base game. Um, and I, I do think it looks pretty like awesome, so we're going to head over to the right side. And we're going to uh, bomb the air, the uh, targets at J-10. I'm in the B-17, so I'm not expecting to live very long. Um, it's gonna be a pretty successful uh, raid if I manage to d go go there, drop my bombs, and get to turn around and try to land. Of course, I'm gonna try and land this beauty as well in first person and the cockpit view. It's gonna be a bitch. Like, don't get me wrong, it's gonna be hard as hell. Um, but for now, let's uh, enjoy the flight. Uh, you want some more coffee, Bob? And he, I think he just, uh, he just nodded, so, uh, hopefully we can get some more coffee. Um, we are getting closer to the target area. There's a couple of, uh, BF-110 spotted. It's enemy scouts. So far, so good. Got a typhoon down below. Our co-pilot is still alive. Our gunners are still alive. Well, one of our gunners is still alive. So far, so good. We're making our way to the target area. We're getting pretty close. Let's see if we can uh, acquire some targets. We're in, we are within the 10 kilometer range. So we're gonna have to get ready. I am gonna have to switch to another view, obviously, to make sure that I bomb correctly. I don't wanna, you know, screw up the bombing. I wanna, you know, actually do something and like, at least try to act, you know, like, uh, like I'm helping my team. Let's uh, whip it up a little bit. Let's try to not climb as much anymore, though. I want to get this in like a slow. I want to get it, like I, I'm not, it, it's climbing by itself. It's alright. I guess it's not too bad. I, could, I guess it could be worse. I'm trying to grab every kilometer speed out of this. There's uh, I think that's Mount Etna when we're talking about Sicily, isn't it? Maybe I'm stupid and we're running it wrong. I, I hope it's mine. Like it look, it looks pretty good. Like whatever it is, it looks pretty cool. Like you know from the cockpit. Here's my, uh, here's my co-pilot. Looks pretty cool. Um, we got some targets popping up. Not sure we're gonna be able to make it back, though. I'm dropping bombs. And by bombs, I mean bomb. I dropped a bomb. It's going to the cockpit, because it's gonna get pretty nasty in a second here when this fucker wolf gets in our ass. We're already under fire. This is not good. I repeat, this is not good. Bombers have been severely nerfed, so I'm not really happy with this. Let's try to stay away, steer away of trouble. There's a fuck wolf on our ass who is not getting able to catch up anytime soon. And, um... I seem to have lost part of my wing. My, my co-pilot is not showing any signs of distress so far. Um... We are definitely not in a good way. Um, reduce speed. What? What's going? Oh crap! Oh oh crap! Bail! 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 Bail, boys! And um, let's 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 get that another try. Hopefully with some more results. All right, welcome aboard this B twenty five J one on Sicily, guys. Um. Wait, what the fuck? How is... Okay, I'm not even going to bother asking what's going on. 
I'll just won't. I'll just, I'll just not ask. All right. If let's always be friends. I won't ask what's going on like back there because that looks, that doesn't look healthy. Anyway, we're in the uh, very bumpy cockpit of the B-25J over Sicily. Uh, so far, my co-pilot has said nothing, and um, I forgot to well, put in ground target belts, so what I have is stealth belts, which isn't bad. Don't get me wrong, it's not bad, it's just that I would have preferred ground target belts, because what we're going to do is we're going to be noobs. We're going to go in low and fast, and we're going to go in and bomb the hell out of anything. And by bomb, I mean we're going to shoot the hell out of everything, because I only have three bombs, and I've got a lot of ammo for those um, machine guns. I think there's five 50 cals on the front of a B-25J1, isn't there? Um, hang on, let's take a look if we can see. I think there's two there, two there, and then there's one right next to the gunner here. So there it is, five 50 cals. So we have about 400 rounds per gun. Well, we have exactly 400 rounds per gun. There's some pretty heavy turbulence going on. This is not a... That is not good. Uh, I decided to switch to the B-25 from the uh, B-17 because... At those tiers, they only need to sneeze at you. They only need to look at you when you die already. And that's not a good thing, let me tell you. It's not a... It's not a good thing. It's definitely annoying. So we're doing like 540 kilometers per hour to fucking be 25. But we're gonna do 550? Jesus Christ. This thing is gonna rip before I reach that though. This is this is pretty good. Like we're uh, this is trying to get some speed, trying to get there before the enemies will get there. I will be a sitting duck, so I'm gonna have to drop my bombs, shoot like one or two uh, targets, and then run my ass back. Just trying to, you know, probably survive. That'd be a great one. So let's lay out the web. And now it's gonna be a point, a thing of like, can we bomb? Actually, I should probably. Oh no, there's a fuck wolf already. That's not good. That's, that's not good, man. That's that's too serious. This is not good though. Yeah, let's start a fuck this fuck wolf literally. Got hit, but I'm not dead. We're just gonna run into these bunkers. Drop one, two, and three bombs, and then let's go into cockpit mode and engage some targets. Okay, aiming is a lot harder than I thought it would be. Also because I'm not using any tracers. This is good. Oh, the fuck wolf veered off. We live to fight another day, comrades. Wait, we're not the Russians. Hang on. Anyway. Let's turn this beauty around. The B-25 is actually a pretty good plane. If they leave you alone, actually pretty much every plane is a good plane to leave you alone, but... The B-25 has so much ammo that you can, especially in the ground attack role, you can spam it quite a lot as you can see. The downside is, and I've already said, is that I'm using the shitty ammo for this, which is not... I should... Come on. There we go, we finally got it. It took some time to get used to it, but I think I got it now. What I, but I, what I need to be using is I need to use ground, like, ammo with tracers. There we go. Now, now we got it going. Now we're doing it. Oh, there's some more like pillboxes. There's artillery over there. Let's see if we can knock that down. There seems to be something on our tail. Oh no, it's an H. Oh crap, it's a B2. That's not good, because that guy might have a 30 mil for all I know. Let's try to uh, evade his fire. Get low to the water here to Lake in Sicily and try to like speak the hell away. Um, he's still chasing us, but the B2 and the uh, B3, but the HS129 in general is um, is not a fast plane, so 
I'm hoping that by oh no oh no oh no oh that was really close damn all right that's I'm hoping we can get away from uh, from these guys I'm just looking okay okay so far so good our pl my plane has heavy listing which is not very good <laughs> I'm not sure what has happened but it seems to be like the, it seems to be not really responding well to controls it seems like to go in like a a one like a full rudder the entire I was pretty close to hitting the water there I'm pretty sure I was like maybe a few feet off from hitting it um, I have to counter rudder this and it's hard because is the rudder like locked let's see if it can like lock the rudder okay okay there we go oh well, well, I, I thought I fixed it for a second but it seems like one of my control services has been hit quite badly um, and I, I do have a little, some sort of a listing. Um, let's thank this guy for saving B25s. He might not have saved me, but you know, I'll just say thank you. So far, we're still alright. We managed to uh, wreck up seven kills. I would have stayed there longer um, if there wasn't, um, if there wasn't, uh, you know, if my, if my plane wasn't acting like this weird. Hopefully, we can at least touch her down on uh, on Sicily Airfield. And, um, uh, um, actually, repair. Um, this guy is really cool, you know, so trying to try and communicate and stuff. Uh, but as I said, no, I was, was going to say, I would have probably stayed around longer if it wasn't for the fact that my, uh, my guy, my, my plane is just like, like a bitch right now. So let's take off the web. Let's sort of line her up for this, uh, runway. It's, it's going to be hard. At least we have, like, this, like, ex elevated view over the nose of the cockpit, though. And I have I have been to this airfield in the game like a few a few times in my uh, in my War Thunder career. So let's hope I don't screw this up like magnificently. Let's hope I actually like manage to push her down. And by push her down, I mean put her down gently. Let's try to find the airfield. Like it's right over there. Gotta get some more speed going. We're still quite a, quite a while away. I'm trying to find follow this ass Rambo guy in A S Rambo, ass Rambo in ass Rambo. That sounds really bad. A S Rambo. Just call him A S Rambo or Rambo. Following Rambo into the airfield, almost like my escort. There seems to be a fight going on behind us. Um, but that's all right, I guess. There's the run. I can see the runway. It just passed this little hill. It's gonna be pretty tough landing on that though. Um, the second I see the runway, I'm just gonna have to like, just like, rush her down on the ground. Let's try to see if we can get out of, out of web. And I have to counter the, um, heavy rudder that my plane seems to want to give it, give the, give you a gift me basically. So I have to put her down gently. Gonna slow down. There's a little bump. I hate it on Sicily. Somebody thought it was a good idea to make a little bump right in front of the runway. So let's see if we can do this. We're going down. We're doing we're going down good. This, this, it has tricycle gears, so we should be able to land this perfectly. Going full flaps, flying flaps, come on, come on, come on. We're going a little bit slow. Let's speed up, speed up, speed up, speed up. And touchdown! Let's try to keep her on the runway. She wants to list a little bit to the left, that's alright. I can't believe I managed to do that. Come on, and put her down nicely. Let's turn her around off the runway, if other people to land. Let's uh, drive her off here. Up the flaps. And Bob's your uncle. So now we just gotta wait, sit here for about 20 seconds talking to my... Wait, is he wearing his goggles? Is that a new... Is that new? I'm not sure if he was using that before. Hmm. Maybe he was, but I can't remember them being so shiny. Those look pretty cool. I think I'm jealous of his goggles now. Hopefully though, with this repair, um, I won't have the issues I was having like 10 seconds ago. You know, making it hard to land. So let's go... Flaps! Brakes, full speed, and release brakes. Oh, look, or oh, the sound is beautiful. Oh, now his glasses are normal again. Eh, interesting, he switched glasses, I think, or goggles then. 
Um, so let's head back over the mountain. So we're going to have to head into a uh, kind of like east, northeast, sorry, uh, west, northwest direction. Let's try to get enough speed, so we're going to speed and go up, flaps, gear. Let's get her up, let's get her up. Probably up my flaps a little bit too fast, but it's all right. And we're going to make our way back to the target location. I am very grateful for some of the uh, great RAF pilots out there tonight. Thank you to Rambo in particular, who apparently saved my ass twice. Um, especially from the, I mean... Although one of the fuck wolves actually just like b veered off of me for no reason other than there were enemy targets for or well, yes, but other targets for me to shoot at. Um, I'm kind of scared like though to like fly into a building so I'm gonna go to about 500 meters altitude and then just go like straight in front and uh, just gun it. And by 500 meters I think 300 meters is more than enough so we're gonna go 300 meters and we're just gonna gun it straight to the target area. Drop some bombs on pillboxes, shoot up some stuff. And damn it, I forgot to jump out of my plane and pick other ammo. That sucks. Right, anyway, we're gonna make it back. We're gonna do some damage to where you know, our ground troops can advance. Because that's gonna be important. Um, we wanna win the mission. So far, there's still some enemies left. Um, although I'm not sure where they are hiding. So let's head over. Let's see, there's a... Uh, what's that? Oh, that's still a Rambo and a Spitfire. We're making... Well, we're getting there quick. Well, we're getting there quickly. It's about 14 kilometers left. And now it's about 14... Okay, I'm not gonna, like, you know, tell you the distance to those targets. That's just super annoying. There's a lot of my pillboxes left, though. That's, uh, that's not good. There's, like, a lot more than I think there was gonna be. Oh, damn. That B-25 is uh, definitely not in a good way right now. He is not feeling good. Luckily, he's probably going to make it back to base, so... He's going to have to buy me beer, because he is smoking, and I'm most definitely not smoking. So we're doing an easy 375-ish kilometers. Well, of course, we're trying to overheat the engines a little bit, trying to see what you know we, what power we can add to this beauty. And uh, lighting up for some of these pillboxes. There's some uh, light flak, light, light shells going over there. We have a um, bogey on top of us. It's a Beef 110 AI making our way. Uh, trying to make a way for the convoy. And then, when we've dropped our bombs, we'll make a way for the convoy with our machine guns. So, let's see, there's a pillbox over there. We'll do one, two, three if we can. It's going to be a pretty tough attack run. Maybe it's probably better to do one, then uh, two, and then three. We'll, we'll have to find out. Let's see what we can do. The tanks are engaging the, uh, the pillboxes, Shermans, and the like. Maybe Lees, who knows. And by Lees, I mean Grants, of course, because they're, they're the British variants of the... You have three leads. Let's take a look. See what we can see. Maybe some Stuarts? Matildas? Hmm, can't really see them though. Alright, here we go. Lay off the web. Bomb away. One, two, and three. We missed two of the bombs. Why do we miss all bombs? Did I take like different bombs this time? All right. Well, that's uh, that's definitely something. Let's. Um... Oh no. Let's turn around and give these Jerry's Watson for like shooting at me and making my plane smoke. Here we go. Let's turn back. Go into gunner view. Get ready. To get nasty. Here we are. AA. Close. No cigar. Oh, ground target destroyed. Artillery. Let's see if we can destroy you before we mess you. There we go. Artillery is severely messed up. This is not a very agile plane, obviously, so I'm not going to put her in too many weird angles. Let's uh, focus on this other artillery piece over here. Let's see. Three, two, one. 
starting to learn these angles a little bit right now. That's good. That's good. Let's head over to the other flank where we can just strafe the entire line from the side and hopefully wreck up some kills. Um, maybe with some luck we're actually able to fly back and uh, get some more ammo. So far the, the scores are pretty even and I'd like to win this one. Let's fly back and see what we can uh, let's see what we can get. Hopefully I'll remember if I, if I get it, if I if I manage to make it back and not crash this thing. Let's hope I remember to take different ammo. Here's some AA. Missed. Got our target destroyed. That's good. That's good. More AA. Kilometer. 100 meters. Let's lit her up. Come on. Come on. Come on. There's trees. There's trees. There's trees. Oh, no. No cigar. No cigar. Abort. Almost ran into the trees there. That was pretty bad. It's because I'm not using. Oh, whip. I should probably get out the whip. Oh, let's hope it didn't ruin my engines already. Yeah! Right, that's good, that's good. So I got a thousand plus rounds left. Let's try to get my. S I'm, I, let's hope I didn't like wreck my engines. I don't want to make the same mistake as I did in the HE111 video where I just over abused my engines a little bit too much, which got me killed in the end. Turn around and uh, go for another sweep. Here's some triple A. Zooming in. And blast off. Close, no cigar. Oh, grind target destroyed. Moving on to some artillery. Start to learn the angles now, there we go. A little bit right there. There we go, now we're talking. Come on, come on, come on. No, abort, abort, abort. Trees. What's left over here? Nothing really, except for a little pillbox. Uh, light pillbox over there. Is that also light pillbox? Or is that, that's, like, oh, that's actually artillery over there. And some artillery over here. Oh no, oh no, 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 pull up, pull up, pull up, pull up! Oh my god, that must have been like super close. Jesus. Got a little bit too risky disky for uh, my likings. Let's turn around. Go do one more sweep over this area over here. And then we'll uh, jump back to base. And hopefully we'll uh, be able to grab another reload or two so we can destroy one or more of these ground targets. I'm scared of my engines still haven't overheated yet, but they're also like smoking. It's not a good it's not a good sign really, black smoke coming from engines, so like pillbox, like pillbox, like pillbox, like pillbox, like pillbox. Here's some AA, here we go. Yes. Ready, steady, fire! Hit, missed. Just hit him. Target destroyed. Target destroyed, good, good, good. Oh, and another one. It's a tree. Three, that's a tree. Damn. It's a three in a row right there. That's pretty good. Let's see if we can uh, had bag. Had, had bag? Had back once more for a, a quick reload. And then after that quick reload, we should probably start like actually bombing stuff. I sh if I take armor targets, I'm pretty sure I can destroy bunkers with the um, some of the 50 cal bullets inside there. I think I'm really afraid of them like killing my engine, especially with the smoke coming out of them, which was not really my fault, but the fault of the flat enemy flat guns hitting me. The oil also doesn't seem to be slow going down, so I'm not feeling too good about this. I'm slow. I'm low. There's no room for me to glide. I think we're gonna have to just gun this now. I think gunning is is probably the best idea out of the two, because doing it l slow is painful to watch and it's also gonna be painful for me to watch when I have no more engines left now I've seen miracles of people <laughs> driving back uh, well, planes uh, in War Thunder when they were like out of engines all the way back to an airfield but on Sicily yeah, not so much I think so I know I'm wrecking my engines I'm trying to not rape them too much like it's still a long way back it's probably like 10 kilometers back 
My engines are still leaking, I think, coolant or oil. Um, who knows? It's going to be a tough one, though, to, to crack this one. If we manage to land again, I'm going to be so proud, though. If we manage to get back to the airfield, it's going to be glorious. Well, let's hope we actually do get back to the airfield. Um... Let's hope we do. Hey there, Bo. What's up? I can... He's shaved. Nice. Nice, nice, nice shave. Alright, so I'm still trying to get my ass back. There's only two bombers left for them to kill. They are really not gonna take uh, a long time to f kill me and my buddy, so... He's over there. He's probably making his way back as well for the second... Uh, maybe he took off, because he was the guy that was smoking earlier. Well, he only has one ground target, though. That's not too good. Um, okay. Let's see if I can see the airfield. Okay, it's the airfield's over there. It's basically behind that hill over there. It's like over behind that hill. Uh, so we're going to have to aim for the hill. Did I press control? I'm stupid. Let's fully rape the engines now. We need to abuse them like we need to now we need to make sure that we get to our new destination damn this is an intense match you don't see these too often it's e it's usually it's like one team just dominates it's like you know like one team gets has like one death and the other team's like absolutely demolished all right start let's, let's try to turn in then let's go down to 80 percent I'm so happy that this plane is a tricycle gear. I think, right? It's a, is it a tricycle gear? It is. Yeah, 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 yeah. It basically means that um, your plane has uh, three sets of wheels, and every set of wheels is, a, is is like the same height. So where a B of one and nine, for example, is a is a tail dragger, where the the, we the rear wheel uh, not only determines the you know. The course of the plane on the ground. It also means that you have to land the plane in a slight, you know, in like, in a slight like climbing angle, because otherwise you would just belly flop. But now we're gonna gear, go, go gear down, zero throttle, press the F for flaps, put her down gently. We are going pretty fast, but the flaps should be able to slow us down a little bit more before we get down. Oh, the, my friend's be, oh no, my friend just been nailed. We managed to to touch down though. That's pretty good though. That's still pretty good. Come on, let's break, 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 break. Is my right wheel not on the ground? It we wow, he wasn't. I don't know how that not. I don't know how that did not kill me. Thing is, I could leave the aircraft and take other ammo, but if I do that, the ticket counter will take it will count down because I'm the only person left on my team. And it will just count down, and I will actually lose the possibility to winning this game. I, you know, I want to see if we can win this game, so I'm going to take the risk. So we're going to sit here, turn off the engines. And wait. And now it's quiet, eerie, very quiet. Very. Wait, there's 35 minutes left in this game. I see, the, um, I see that they're getting engaged up there. Go full speed. Hold brake. And release. Oh, here he is. There's a, there's a bogey. 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 That's not good. Let's start to get as much speed as possible. What we're going to have to do is we're going to either have to kill them with our gunners, kill them with our front machine guns, or hope that the flak of the airfield is good enough today and they haven't... Well, I mean, they've, like, they've been drinking their tea, hopefully. This guy's going to be out for that final kill of the match. If it's that LT Forest guy, he wants his ace. He desperately is going to want that ace. Let's drop the gear up. Do 100%. No web. There's a, the other bogus we spotted too. He's right there. It's hard to spot him right now, but he's right there. Right there. Right there. Right there. Right there. Right there. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's LT Forest. He definitely wants to get that second kill. He, he definitely wants to get that kill, which gives him an ace. 
Or we're not, which we're not gonna fucking do. We're not gonna just give him an extra kill. We're gonna make him work for it. Obviously, I'm a bomber, so I'm a one-shot kill. But hey, I'll try. I'm gonna drop my bombs so I'm a little bit lighter. And I'll switch to gunner view. And let's hope. Oh, it's a 410. That guy's gonna eat me to shreds. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on! Put her down! Oh, fuck. No. No, that sucks. Well. <laughs> it was pretty intense, though. I hope you guys enjoyed it. I surely did. I really liked the, the cockpits. Check the link from the description, obviously, for uh, the download link to the, the cockpits. And, um... Uh, yeah, I guess I'll see you in the next one. Don't forget to stay awesome. Ciao! You claim it's love that you never started. You once destroyed a broken heart that was already shattered. Hold it on to what we have. You take us to the edge and back. Hold it on to what.